You know, I think it's safe to say this might be my absolute favorite mission in the entire game, just because of the unexpected nature of what happens. I don't want to spoil anything, but I hope you like it. <laughs> it is an awesome mission, and it's actually like this video, next video, kind of finish it, because it was such a long one. But anyways, love you all. If you want more of the series, just keep it up. All the likes, greatly appreciated. And let's go ahead and get this. We go ahead and head back. Rather than... Hold on. I think what I will do... Let me go to the actual missions really quick. Yeah, so let's just go here. I'm just going to set course and just see where it takes it. It kind of auto-does it for you, which is kind of nice. I love that you don't have to actually get back to the ship or anything. Satellite. Uh-oh. Explosions are energy research lab. Massive damage. Overrun. Requesting emergency evac. Please. Oh, hold on. Investigate the distress signal. Why, why am I flying into it? Like, what is going on? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, the spot really quick. Uh, I would like to help them, but really don't know what I should do yet. Cause I'm like low on hills. We're almost done with this main objective. I kind of want to go here. Is it? Hold on. Is it part of the? Oh, so it's a main mission. Interesting. That's funny how this one was like. Pretty much everything we just did. Okay, we're still doing this one. So we gotta finish. To finish this, we gotta finish this one. To finish this one, we gotta finish Entangled. All right. Here we go. Critical path. That's what I'm on right now. You already know. If this is a stress signal, we're gonna be fighting a lot of enemies, probably. I gotta find like an AR or something that I can use. It's decent at least. All right, here we go. I feel like this is about to be a nightmare. All right, uh, let me see something really quick. How much ammo do I have for this? It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it is poison. So let's just see. If I don't have any, I'll just yeah. Okay. It's funny how I don't have hardly anything for some of these guns. Just gonna reload everything just in case. But keep my eyes peeled for any kind of meds and stuff. I'm probably gonna miss some, but we're gonna get Baron an actual like power because I feel like that's gonna be the key to some of these fights. Hold on, can I give him a gun? He's unarmed right now. This is amazing. The, the, the unity. Wait, we asked him. Oh, we asked him this earlier and then it. Let me no just skip kid. all this. This explains so much. They're yeah, we, we did this we earlier and out, I guess it just it didn't save so it because when I died. True. That's or fine. I'll just skip all, all this as quick as I can. Lose yourself. It is what it is. What? No. Just part of my pro Of course. And our entire... Why would we stop? I'm with you. But if you... Because he's about to ask about it. Anytime. Like the power and all that. You're guiding... Uh... It's not on the... Talk you later, yeah. Let's talk. I was just going to assume there's an option to like, hand him a weapon. Because I felt bad every time we're in combat. He's like... Using hand-to-hand -hand techniques over there. Yo, what is this purple thing over here? Workbench for the spacesuit. You know, as much as I would love to increase X, Y, and Z and all that. I just feel like I want to save up for a ship no matter what. You can modify so much stuff in this game. Take that toxin really quick. 
Oh, it's advanced. Perfect. All right, so we got just two, but it looks like the first one is one, two. So it's four and then five. So let's do, if there's actually a four, which this looks kind of like it would be. Now they're too far apart. Okay, so we're gonna have to do two, two. Do that one and then probably this, not too far back. Here we go. That one, now we gotta do, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. We gotta do three, and then... What would be that one? Let's try that, and then... Nah, it's not gonna work. Undo. Let me just redo it, hold on. That has to be right for the first one, okay. This one I'm not sure about. So you got the three, and it looks like... Ah, okay. I'll just use those and then just use this one, right? Easy peasy. We got a leather jumpsuit. I'll take it. Uh, click. You got it. Hey, stranger. Let's chat sometime, okay? You got it, Barrett. We got a research station, okay. I feel like a sniper rifle is probably not going to be the play here, but whatever. Mission research station. You speaking. What is your business here? Uh, yeah, responding. What? We haven't sent a distress signal. Nothing on the comms. No other ships in the system since our last supply drop. Look, what are you trying to pull here? Maybe I was mistaken. Out here. We'd have picked it up. Make sure no one else. Yeah. I might. Let's ask this one on. Yes, I am sure. If there was an emergency, I'd be the one sending it. All right. Really? The high energy research lab. All right. I don't know what's going on here, but you should talk with the director. For security, I'm going to have to ask your friend to wait out there. What's inside? Stay with me and don't make any sudden moves. I'll get the door. Welcome to Nishina. All right. There we go. Please be friendly. That's all I'm asking. Just for a smooth area for a little bit. Step forward. Scan has clear. One moment. Retrieve waiting followers, okay. Attention all. I am declaring a cordial. All sections are now on lockdown. Senior staff, protocol, Delta. Use up. There. Be right with you. I feel like the main missions for this game are actually really well, like, put together, you know? Because they take you to a lot of different, like, vast areas of the game that you probably wouldn't go if you weren't doing the story, you know? Speak to Ethan, here we go. Ethan Hughes, Chief of Security. If you'll follow me, I'll show you to the director. All right, let's go. Who's the director? Actually, yeah. Kaya Patel, our administrator and research director. 28 years in quantum particle physics, or so I'm told. It's beyond me. All right, let's go. We'll take the back way up. I got a healing out here or what? I'll take some milk, why not? Milk kit. Don't take those really quick, too. Here, you can see our lovely storage area. Don't touch anything. All right, so don't touch anything so, now. Uh, uh, what just happened? I'm not sure what just went down, but I'm definitely on the edge of my seat right now. Three and two. Uh, there's two that are kind of far apart, but ah, it's too far. Yeah, it's not gonna work. 
Undo that one. Okay. Let's think this through really quick. Um, that one, and then this one for the two on the bottom. And now we need one, two, three, four, five. And we only have these left, so it's got to be these. That one, and then these two go right here. Easy peasy. What we got? Pacifier shotgun. Let me go and see that thing real quick. Hold on, it uses 15 by 25 CLL shell. Okay, what does the other ones use? Caseless shell, and then this one was a different one. Okay. I don't even know if I have this. I have ammo for this? Let's see. Oh, I do. Ooh, hold on. Let me put that on a favorite slot really quick just so I don't forget it. Uh, let's put it on seven, I guess. I should arrange them by like type, but whatever. I just kind of threw them on quickly. All right, so we're really intrigued. So does that character not even exist, or are we being like, do we get pulled? You know. What the? Easy, easy. What the hell was that? You tell me. Uh. What? One minute you're following me, and then you're just gone. Minute later, you pop in out of nowhere, looking like you were in the middle of a fight. Yeah, it was. There were some scorpions. <laughs> in our storage room. I should have never let you inside. What is this? Some kind of stealth tick? Who are you working for? Yeah, I'm not lying. I mean, it's kind of like... <sighs> Look, I don't know what's going on. Let's get you to the director. Maybe she can figure this out. All I know is that was wild. I was not expecting on, that at all. This way. This is the thing that was actually in the corner. Okay. Uh, one and two. Let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five. And then we got one, two, three, four, five again. Okay. So we got three, three, two, two. Okay. Um. I think this one's going to be like this. No. Undo. Mess that up already. Man, I wish this could be like a different spot. Undo that again. It's, it's got to be this one. Yeah, there's no other way. Now we're going to do like one on one side, one on the other. It's going to be like this. No, really? It's this one then. All the way around. Boom. There it is. Okay. And now two, and then these two. Bam. Alright. Oh man, look at that legendary pistol. It just looks like a 1911. That's funny. Zero wire. Okay. 30% damage against aliens. Exterminator perk. Okay. Hand loading. Okay. That's actually nuts. I was not expecting that. Alright. Small chance to demoralize a target. I don't know what that does or what that means, but best believe I'm putting this on right now. Yeah, it's a 45, so 1911 is exactly right. Interesting. Let's go ahead and also put this on a favorite slot. I'll rearrange them later on, but for now, I just want to just have this ready. Ooh, that's clean. All right. I don't like this at all. Huh? Who's there? Who are you? What in the world? Oh, oh, thank God. Finally, someone came. The distress signal. You picked up the distress signal, right? Medicine. You're in bad shape. Yeah, yeah. I know. I wouldn't have made it much longer. It's been so long. I'm out of food. Out of water. But I made it. I... Wait. How did you get in here? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm wondering. What? What are you talking about? No. No, no, no. This doesn't make any sense. Unless... The accident. Maybe... Maybe this is a side effect of the accident. If the 
probe is still feeding power to the distortion, then... Yeah, probe, distortion, let's see. Right, sorry. Three months ago, I was calibrating an experiment in our high-energy research lab. There was an accident. An explosion. It caused a gas leak. Sparked a fire. I was trapped in the control room. There was nothing I could do. They're... They're all dead. You describe... Yeah, describe it, I guess. Oh, wait! Hang on, let's do this one. An artifact? You mean... The metallic god? Yeah. Alright, we well... We're between two dimensions right now, it feels like. Alright, we're on our way up. Who's out? I was just feeling in the direction. All right, we got a bench there. We got two of them. Okay. Come on. Kind of has that Matrix vibe, like you're in the real world and then you're not. Also have like Silent Hill vibes right now. Oh, is that a skeleton back there? will play very passive against a lot of these enemies. As I say that, as they charge me. Okay. How you doing? What does this journal say? Okay. Uh, for to pause it if you need to. I'm gonna be here a long time. I'm trying to read that. I'm sure it gives a nice backstory and everything. Stay cool. And a med pack. Okay. Pharmaceutical lab, what is this gonna do? Ah, okay. Bandages, let's see. Infections, contusions, lacerations, puncture wounds, let's see. Burns and frostbite. Snake oil, okay. Brain injury. Hypothermia, okay. So that's where you can also get immune craft everything. Take those. Just in case. Oh, hold on. Wait, if you sleep? Yeah, but oh, enemies are nearby. Okay. <laughs> Say no more. Take some credits. Because your boy is broke over here. Getting like some Callisto Protocol vibes right now. This way, let's go. This way. <laughs> Is he seeing me like shoot everything? Is it like William Defoe in Boondock Saints when he's like at the crime scene shooting the gun in the air? And it's like, if you really think about it, is he out in the middle of the road just shooting his gun in the sky? Come in. Kaya Patel, research director. And this is our chief scientist, Maria Hughes. Ethan said you disappeared right in front of him. Twice now? Three times? Director, you can't be taking this seriously. Look, I don't know who you are or what you're doing here, but there has to be a rational explanation for all of this. I'm shifting to an alternate universe or something, yeah. Excuse me? That is quite a claim. What makes you think that? Tell us about this other universe. Raphael. Raphael died in the accident. He... Wait. Gas fire. Gas fire. The leak. Director, there was a hydrogen leak right after the accident. It was contained in a minute or two. But if it hadn't been, it could well have caused an explosion. Another universe, though. That's a lot to swallow. We're not sure. 
Raphael was in the lab near the ventilation controls. He could have stopped it. Maybe he did. Or died trying. Hmm. Presumed dead. The research level has been locked down since the accident. We still don't know exactly what happened. If he survived, he could have ended the lockdown, but... You mean this other Raphael? No. How could we possibly do that? Raphael was a colleague and a friend. If there was some way to help him, I would. But it does seem unlikely. Alright, tell me about the accident, yeah. This facility and the research level two kilometers beneath us were built to study a gravitational distortion. Three months ago, our chief engineer, Raphael, was calibrating an experimental probe when something went wrong. We still don't know what happened. There was a series of explosions and somehow it's still running. All right. Uh... What do you think we haven't tried? The kill switch on the control unit isn't responding. The explosion must have damaged the failsafe. We could shut it off manually, but the entire research level is locked down. We can't even get down there. This distortion is an artifact, yeah. An artifact? What, is this some kind of cult? Maria, they're connected to other universes, clearly. And you have some connection with them, then. Interesting. I wonder if that's why this is only affecting you. How? I told you the research level's locked down. We can't even use the damn elevator. Now, uh, let's see. So it's hopeless then. Let's see. So that's what you're after. Fine. And I want this lockdown to end. Perhaps we can help each other. We can't get to the lab. But you might be able to. In this other universe, Raphael survived. He made it back from the lab. So clearly, his elevator works. Take it. And you might be able to shut down the experiment. This is crazy. But first, we have to do something about your shifting. Yeah, I'm open to all suggestions here. We can't shut down the probe, but we might be able to adjust some of the other parameters. It's risky. We don't know what we're dealing with, but... <sighs> All right. It's worth a try. Then it sounds like we have a plan. All right, follow Maria. Come with me. The control unit is in the fabrication lab next door. I think whoever designed this mission deserves a raise. What have we gotten ourselves into? Is this, like, probably the most intriguing part of the entire game? Skelton's just at the reception desk, all right? I'm just surprised the TV still has power. What was that? Oh my god. Okay, I have two shots and I missed. Getting some straight up aliens vibes right now. gotta be something decent here right hold on it's advanced we got one and two let's see one two three one two three so that's six six and then five okay let's try doing ah oh, that wouldn't work that's one right there and then we need a three that's kind of all semi spread out maybe this one no I wouldn't that's not gonna reach okay uh No, that's not going to work either. Go back. Might have to do this one with 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Uh, I think that might be the play here. But there's... Actually, no, that wouldn't work because there's... If we do that, this other one... Let's see what this does first. That's going to put that there. Okay. Let's try this one first. Not going to work there. But if we go like... No, that's not going to work either.
Man, I really just don't know. It's like, none of these seem like they're gonna work. You know? Because they have to be one and two. Maybe this one and then this right here will work? Oh, it's so close. I can't undo anymore. Oh, well. Uh, best I can do is just... That's a four right there. I just, I just saw the four. Let me just exit. Will cost... You know what? Whatever. I'm not gonna worry about it. I think if we did like the four and then a two, it would work there probably, but I don't feel like wasting my picks if I don't have to. I'm gonna go around to the left, I bet. I'm only looting these. I guess glands and stuff just because I don't know if they're rare or not. Level 25? Are you kidding? Okay. They can dig and then reappear behind you. Gotcha. Makes sense. you what happened you disappeared and the ceiling caved in and and uh, i thought i'd finally lost it met with the director we have to shut this yeah there we go. what how look if you think things are bad up here the research level is even worse i barely made it out and that was months ago i don't understand any of this if i hadn't seen you disappear with my own eyes I wouldn't have believed it. I... Okay, okay. You're my ticket out of here. We'll do this your way. We can get out through the pantry. Here's the key. I'll back you up, I guess. Alright, we got some company. Before we go anywhere, I want to leave, like, look back here. Uh, no loot. Take those. to clear this out assuming the rest of the building doesn't come down on top of us hmm how should I know you're the one who keeps winking in and out of existence I just want to get out of here go do whatever you're going to do I'll see if I can clear a path to the door all right what will happen when I shut the probe down yeah okay. I'm not sure it might stop whatever's happening to you it's a reasonable theory, I guess. Alright, here goes! What? I... Oh, it's you. You realize you just popped into my locked office. So much for security protocols. Just open the doors, please, yeah. Oh, I see the top one. Uh, sure. Down the hall. Take the stairs next to the atrium. Yeah, let me get the doors for you. And done. Is there anything else you need? Are there any scorpions native to this planet? Yeah. Uh, yes. Kataxi. Nasty things. The original survey team ran across them. You're welcome to read the old logs if you want. Yeah, I'll unlock the terminal for you. Persuade, interesting. The Kataxi in the other universe. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. I've got an experimental thing one of the engineers put together. 
but uh, we gotta get to six. Okay, hand it over now. Oh my God, you're serious, aren't you? Now we need four. I mean, we could just go direct, right? Give me a second. I am thinking about it. All right. Yeah. It's never been field tested, but all yours. Hey, nice rare shotgun. Okay. All right, before we go anywhere, hold on. <laughs> Let me just look at this thing really quick. Man, this is nice. So what I might do with this one is favorites. Put it nine, I guess. Really need to like loot around a little bit. Okay. Yo, this gun is kind of nice. Soon, right there. Hold on, do these weigh a lot? Let me hold on. Let me just look at my mist really quick. None of these have any kind of weight, so where would it be at? Resources, I guess. These glands. I don't weigh that much. That pack. Hey, let's get it. Gun has a lot of ammo, at least right now. That scared me so bad. Laser pistol, interesting. I'll take it, I guess. There's gotta be like a big boss of this area, you know what I mean? Like a giant one of these. Gotta be getting close. Credits. All right, speak to Maria. Hold on, before we do anything. I don't know why I took the other thing. <laughs> I just kind of grabbed it. What? Did you get lost in the hallway? Uh, yes, I did actually. <sighs> right. This is the probe control unit. Most of these controls aren't responding. I'm going to very carefully adjust the settings I can. There's no way to tell what's about to happen. Pay attention and be ready for anything. I'll begin by adjusting the energy feed of the electron beam array. We're at 93 terawatts. Calibrating to 95, 97, 100. Ugh, nothing. Let's try the other way. 91, 89. Okay, okay. It looks safe to approach, but what in the world? Oh wow, look at that. It's, hey, it's like those things. Flux pattern matches the distortion in the lab. The setting is just exposing it somehow. into the distortion please so this is kind of like when we went to that ring anomaly that one time I don't know what part number it was like part seven maybe and I remember like you had to keep collecting them and it kept speeding everything up all right here we go nothing no hold on there's a slight pattern change some kind of resonance 
back up for a moment. Calibrating to 90, 91. I'm just hoping we can save our friend. What happened? Are you alright? It worked. Yeah, here we go. So, the lower setting causes the distortions to manifest, and the higher causes you to shift. That seems promising. Keep it on the lower setting until you want to shift, and you should be able to avoid any more accidents. I'd give you my control unit, but it looks like you already have one from the other universe. Love to take a look at that when this is all over. All right, shut it down. Right. If you can get down to the research level, you need to make your way to the high energy research lab. Disengage the power interlocks, then pull the emergency shutdown to stop the probe. That should finally put an end to all this. Oh, and before you go, the director wanted to speak with you. Try not to get lost in the hallway again. I can now see why they said a lot of this game opens up near the end. Because I feel like every hour or so we get like something new. You know what I mean? Well then, all set? If you need supplies, I've asked Dr. Barakova to take care of you. It's the least I can do after everything we've put you through. Before you go, there is one other thing we should discuss. If this experiment is the cause of your shifting, when you shut it down, the shifting will stop. What happens then? To you and to us. Uh, you tell me, yeah. Nishina is a closed system. Two potential states held in tension. When you shut down the experiment, that tension will resolve. You are the outside observer in the system. Whichever reality you are in, at that moment, is what will become real. For you, and your universe, at least. The question is, which will you choose? Uh, I don't know I'm going to choose you, this universe. I mean, I would like to help him, honestly. I see. Hmm. If this were a choice between my life and Raphael's, I would ask you to save him. But as the director of the station, I am responsible for the lives of my staff. Thirty people. People with families, careers, futures ahead of them. In this universe. I won't beg. It's not an easy decision. And perhaps things will still work out for us in the end. Perhaps. Now, it's time you are going. With the network offline, we can't shut down the security system on the research level, so you can expect some resistance. Be careful. Ethan, unlock the elevator lobby, please. Ma'am, research level is still locked down. I'm aware of that. I... All right. Done. Good luck, dear. It's been a fascinating day. All right, optionals get supplies. The other one is just take the elevator. What is this one down here? Okay. Hello. So everybody's just shut out eating. It's like, it's like in the wall, kind of. We're not opening that, okay. Keep it together. Keep it together. Same stuff as before, okay. Backpack, okay. Uh, backpack stands for the side of the wall, I guess. Don't quite know. Hold on, let me... Let me go back really quick. Don't touch me. Sorry. <laughs> Don't mind me! Need something. Yes? 
This is probably the best gun I've gotten so far. Besides maybe like the 1911 or whatever. But I haven't really shot that because it didn't have a lot of ammo. 